Hello everybody, welcome to Boom Beach. So uh, I just decided to start playing this. Uh, I was having a bit of a mess around the other day um, with uh, something called Blue Apps or Blue Stacks, something like that. I don't know. It's uh, basically a uh, it's a way of playing Android and mobile devices on your computer. And uh, decided to download that and uh, play, you know, a little bit of a uh, app game. So uh, these are pretty basic games, really, but. Uh, I've been playing Boom Beach, just messing around with it on uh, my phone for a while now, and uh, I really enjoy it, so I thought, sod it, why not uh, actually record it on the PC and uh, make a little series out of it? So uh, that is what we're going to be doing today. Uh, these episodes won't be coming too often, and uh, there'll be a lot of cuts in there and all that, because basically this is one of these games where you've got to wait for things to, you know, rank up and uh, actually, <coughs> you know, say like this little building here, you can upgrade it. Uh, at the start it'll probably take about 10 seconds for the first upgrade but then the next upgrade will take five minutes then it goes on to hour and then f two hours then about four hours and uh, some of them can take absolutely ages so uh, as and when i'll uh, keep playing it a little bit and uh, just uh, yeah basically show you guys uh, my progress and stuff like that so i just thought it was a you know, bit of a chill out kind of game and uh, just a bit of fun so for those of you that haven't played it it's totally free i think on your uh, your mobile and also on your your you know, your PC through this uh, Blue Stacks uh, app program thing, and uh, yeah, basically there's quite a lot to do in it. You've got your home base here, which you can uh, upgrade and um, defend. Basically, the the whole heart of it is this: your headquarters. You've got to protect your headquarters, um, and you can upgrade your headquarters and things like that. So this is your home base. Uh, there's also your attack force down here on the right hand side, uh, bottom right you've got a landing ship and a gunboat that you can use to attack and raid other people, raid uh, AI villages and things like that. But there's plenty of other things you can do in it and uh, yeah, basically we'll just go through it. So, uh, Commando, we've made a successful landing. There we go. This will be our base of operations against a Blackguard threat. There we go. So I've got to get used to uh, the controls of this. We can't let the enemy surprise us. Let's build a sniper tower. We need eyes on the horizon at all times. So we go down here and uh, we've got 1,600 coins, 400 wood and 50 diamonds. Diamonds can be purchased um, on your mobile through uh, money and things like that. But you can also get them for doing a few little challenges, things like that. So up here we've got my level. I'm level 1. Uh, I am a commander. This is uh, victory points, rewards. Uh, every time you do something like uh, raid someone's base, you've got a chance of getting one or two of them. Um, I believe your opponents, yeah, your, your, your rival opponents are also like randomly assigned to your, your victory point rank or something like that. So uh, let's go ahead and get a sniper tower built. Oh, I didn't want to do that. How, now, how do I zoom in? Do I uh, shift? No. How do I zoom in? Can I zoom in? I don't know if I can zoom in. Damn it. I won't mind zooming in. No. That's just going to uh, place me up and down. Well, it doesn't matter anyway. So, um, how do I move? Ah. Ah, that's how we zoom in. Okay, I get that then. But how do I move that? Do I just click on it? Do I drag it? Uh, <laughs> I don't know the controls. Right, I'll be back in a second after I've worked that out. Okay, I have absolutely no idea how to uh, how to actually do this, but uh, all I'm going to do is just place it, and I reckon it might let you uh, you do it once it's built, hopefully. So there is our sniper tower. Oh, I missed that. I am Lieutenant Hammerman of the Black Guard. These islands belong to us now. We'll crush your puny base. Let's hope our sniper tower can hold off the attack. Let's watch this fight. Oh, they've gone for my base. Well, that was a rubbish thing. You should have focused on the sniper tower, you idiots. So he's got four troops going. They're basically trying to attack us. And uh, yeah, our sniper tower is holding them off nicely. There we go. So you beat back my scouts. Next time I won't make it a fair fight. Our sniper won the day. Give that man a medal. We need to take the initiative and free our neighbouring islands. Let's get a strike force ready. Assign rifleman to a landing craft. So we go here. We add that. And uh, it's going to take five minutes for... Uh, oh no, five seconds now. They normally take about five minutes, I think, to, uh, to load up. There we go. We need another landing craft for a strong enough strike force. Let's build another landing craft then. 150 wood. 
We can get a radar on the go as well. Boom, there we go. Let's load this craft up with more riflemen. Boosh. Get in. There we go. Ten guys now. Rifleman ready. Let's take the fight to the enemy. Right. Off we go then. Enemy base level one. Select artillery. So we've only got the uh, the shot. Um, the I forgot what you call them now. The missiles basically. Tap an enemy building to fire your artillery. So uh, this is telling me it's going to take three uh, energy points, and we've got twelve. The only thing we need to take out is this at the minute. All these uh, don't actually hurt you. So as long as we take this thing out. Oh, we ain't got quite enough. But uh, let's uh, land the troops on the beach then. And hope they can take that out pretty quickly. They should be able to. One shot should uh, take that guy out. Big machine gun. Get down. There we go. And then, uh, yep, we've got another one. So let's just go and shoot the base. There we go. Now these guys shouldn't take very long at all. Yes! <clears throat> Down they go. Thank you for driving away the invaders. We will return the favour. So now this village is free, they will give us money. We also earned uh, a medal, 640 coins and more wood. No casualties as well, so we don't have to uh, f fill the craft up again. Great job, we destroyed the enemy base and saved the local islanders. Let's go back to home base. So uh, I can just click on there, I'll just click down here. Commander, we need to build up this base and increase our strength. The Blackguard are evil. We'll fight them on the beaches and never surrender. Thank you for freeing us. Here is some gold to help you fight the bad guys. If you free other villages, I'm sure their tribes will pitch in and help. So I've basically just got to uh, go ahead and uh, keep doing that. And they'll send ships with more money. So free coins. Thank you. Optional update. Commander, we realise the an optional Bloom Beach update to fix missing submarine dive timers and crashing. Well, we ain't got a submarine for a long time anyway, so uh, I'll do that eventually. There we go. Let's close that down then. So, you've got your challenges here as well. So, uh, upgrade headquarters to level 3. I'm at level 1. When I do that, I'll get 10 diamonds. Load of other challenges and things like that as well to look through. So, uh, let's do that and that. I can upgrade my landing craft now. I can upgrade my gunboat. I can upgrade my headquarters. I'm going to upgrade my headquarters because that is a good thing to do. Uh, you can do it instantly for seven diamonds or it'll take five minutes. Uh, have we got enough wood? Yeah, plenty of wood. Plenty of coins. Um, also, when I can, I'm going to build a radar and some gold storage as well. Now, uh, these trees here um, and stone, you can dig up, but you need higher level um, headquarters. But I can now use this to uh, pay 600 coins to get 300 wood. Uh, but obviously they rank up, so basic mangrove trees and young mangroves I can at the minute. Old mangrove there, but there's like thickets. You need headquarters level 11 to get that, which is uh, quite a long process, really. And you spend your money on things, um, little things like upgrades as well and stuff like that. So let's try and see if I can move this sniper tower now. So I want my base to be, yes, that's how you do it. I want my base to be there. I'll put my sawmill right next to it if I can. There. Um, and my residence there. I just want to try and block this off so the sniper tower can take away, yeah, take all, uh, people on. So they've got to take the sniper tower down before they can actually... Uh, hurt my uh, headquarters so uh, let's have a little look see if anything can do oh we've got chest here with some diamonds in five diamonds lovely so uh, let's go ahead and uh, explore so we've got some people to take out there that's all I'm going to spend my money on at the minute thank you for the diamonds now we do need a bigger radar as well we have now explored everything as far as the eye can see let's build a radar to discover more islands yes I will do that soon but at the minute, there's a level 1 there, so let's go and scout that out. Ah, yes, there we go. Just one sniper tower then. We can attack that. That shouldn't be too hard at all. Let's get two clicks down and see what that does. No, nope. one more would have done that then, but uh, we'll go ahead and get the old troops down. They're going to go straight for uh, the boxes, which we what we don't want because it's going to take our guys out. We need them to... Uh, oh, let's get that sniper tower down now. There we go. 
We haven't lost anyone either. Just about to lose him, but um, I think the next thing you can get on the boat is a, a flare, which basically the troops will go towards the flare. Then uh, you can just tell him where to go, basically, where to focus the attack on. Grab all power stones, drop everything else, and let's get out of here. Thank you for saving us. Those men imprisoned us and took our holy idols. Well, you are free once again. There we go. Look at that. Stocking up on the coins and the wood. Beautiful. Uh, we won't attack anyone else yet because we don't want to uh, max ourselves out on uh, the coins at the minute. We need to build a radar. But we've got 2 minutes 7 seconds to wait before we can do that. Um, yeah, let's get the radar. Can I build the radar while it's still upgrading? Let's put the radar up here. Yes, you can only build one building at a time. So I've got to wait 1 minute 50 seconds. So I will see you guys in a second. Right, we are back and we have about six, five, four, three seconds left to go. So our headquarters will be upgraded, which means we get a few more unlocks, which means we have these guys. Nice. Hey, great. The HQ is finally big enough for us heavies. We're tough enough to walk straight into the line of fire. Let's go get them. Right. So unfortunately for you guys, we're going to change troops and we're going to get one heavy as well. Uh, he's going to go in and take the brunt of the fire. Uh, and then we can go in and um, actually kill, uh, well, he'll sit there bullet sponging and uh, these guys can also help. Uh, these aren't the most powerful guys, but uh, they're definitely, definitely not too bad really. So let's zoom in a little bit. Right, we need to take the coins and take the wood. So we've got seven things we can build now. But the first thing we want to do is build the radar. That is uh, going to unlock more places. So all of this here will be unlocked so we've got more people we can take out and things like that uh, which will be pretty good so uh, what else do we can we do let's just have a quick look at what we can do so uh, we're not going to be able to get another landing craft till headquarters level 4 which shouldn't take too long uh, level 4 we'll get an armory there as well so we can upgrade our forces it will give us something to spend our coins on as well um, the sculptor is basically uh, you can make statues from these little shards that you collect uh, and they give you like bonus things like uh, you know the base defense or troop attack damage and stuff like that the submarine uh, allows you to dive for coins that takes ages though um, so I use your coins to dive and uh, get extra warden items and stuff like that uh, I haven't actually got to headquarters level 15 yet on my uh, on my phone version of it I'm actually at like level 12 I think so uh, I haven't got weapon lab but that looks quite interesting create powerful but unstable prototype defenses uh, and of course we've just built the radar so that's you can only have one radar so defense we can get another sniper tower on the go and we can also put some mines down so uh, we'll go ahead and put some mines down now very quickly um, yes where do I want them let me just stick them down for now and then we'll move them eventually so we're not going to be able to get any more now till headquarters level 4 we've only got 36 seconds left on the radar that's good how much is it going to cost me to it's going to cost me 1,900 to upgrade again. So we're going to leave that for now. I want to build. I like to build everything um, before I actually upgrade my headquarters. Um, so with defense, you've got uh, sniper towers, your mines. Then you've got these mortars. They're like big cannons that have a big radius where they fire. They're not too uh, damaging, but they, they do chip away now and again. Again, me, machine guns aren't bad, but they're not really powerful. It's these guys that really do the damage, the cannons. They're pretty good. Flamethrowers, very good, but they're very short range. Boom mines are massive um, mines, basically, just a bit better. And again, I haven't quite got to the... In fact, no, I'm not level headquarters level 12 on my phone. I'm at 11, because I haven't got a boom cannon yet, but these guys are pretty big. Rocket launchers are uh, a very, very long-distance thing. Not a massive damage, but they, uh, you can put them like right in the top corner of your base, and they will get the whole, they'll cover the whole base, really. And then you've got the shock launcher, which uh, actually stops the troops from moving. Um, economy, how much is... Oh, it's three seconds for a sniper tower, may as well build that quickly then. So uh, let's get that down very quickly. Nice, nice, nice. There we go, we've got two sniper towers now. Economy, we've got some uh, residents, they make their own gold. Um, gold storage, wood storage and a vault. So uh, the vault actually keeps your resources safe as you can see. Eventually you get a stone as well and then uh, onto iron. So uh, we've got all that to do. Uh, but yeah, basically, let's, um, let's have a look. So, yeah, we're, uh, 
we're two minutes 30 seconds away from that so i'm going to uh, i'm going to wait for that to come up and uh, then we'll we'll have a fight uh, before ending the episode so we've got all the basics done now and uh, yeah pretty happy with the progress so far so let's have a little bit of a rearrange while we've uh, we've got our basic layout of the base so i'm going to stick the headquarters just here uh, and then i'm going to put two sniper towers either side of it uh, let's uh, get this out of the way force people to actually uh, come here let's uh, let's make a two wide gap actually there we go that'll do uh, and then we'll just stick the radar over here somewhere and the wood storage over here and the residence there and we'll put a couple of mines down here just to uh, chip away at the enemy if they come near. Hmm. Don't want them too close. Again, not the best strategy at the minute, but uh, we're very low level, so we shouldn't have too much trouble with uh, people. So, uh, heavies actually cost four, I think. And we've only got a maximum capacity of five, but we can upgrade. So uh, it'd be probably be a good idea at some point to uh, try and get one of these crafts up to eight, so we can uh, get two heavies on the go. Um, right, well, uh, we're just a just a waiting game now. Uh, let's go and scout out what we're going to do. I'm probably just going to go for the level one. So let's go and have a scout out of this and uh, see what the trouble is. So there's just one machine gun. Uh, we could probably take that down mostly uh, with the. Uh, missiles, two shots of the missile, so uh, that should be pretty easy. We shouldn't even need to use the heavies, but we could probably do that with our one landing craft of five guys. But uh, we'll, we'll wait for the heavies, and I'll give you a little demonstration of that. And uh, yeah, we'll put something on upgrade as well while we're waiting. What can we put on upgrade? Um, sniper tower, I'm thinking, or maybe maybe sawmill. Get the wood production going. What's going to take no time at all? That's going to take five minutes. That's going to take five minutes. I think they'll all probably end up taking five minutes. Yeah, they will. So uh, let's just stick that on upgrade. Get that. So the health is going to go up from 1700 to 150. Damage per second is going to go up to 44. And uh, we'll get two experience points for that as well. So uh, yeah, we'll stick that on upgrade. And uh, let's go for a fight then. So we've got our heavy loaded up and ready to go. So let's uh, attack that for 140 coins. Uh, we'll get the missile down, try and take these guys out. So, uh, yeah, we'll let him land first, just there. And then these guys can land behind him. And, uh, yeah, this guy's just going to sponge it all. There you go, look, as you can see, one of these guys would have been dead by now. But not this guy. So let's uh, get a shot going down at the headquarters. Can't wait to get the flare, because we could avoid all this now. I'm just telling him to go and attack that base straight away. Yes, another rocket. Let's go. Bush. And a down. Nice. There you go. That is a uh, legit low-level strategy there. Thank you for freeing us. They made us work for days without food or rest. Well, again, not anymore. The village is free once again. We have one medal, 735 coins, and 476 wood. Nice, nice, nice. So we've got plenty of money at the minute. So what I'm going to do is uh, just go around and uh, just spend it rat's nest shell shock and uh, oh there we go more diamonds so we've got one two three four five six places we can attack uh, but we'll do that in the next episode and uh, yeah there you go anyway guys so that's boom beach so like i said uh, it won't be coming too often this but uh for now, we're going to uh, just play away and uh, have a bit of fun with it. So really hope you enjoy this anyway. And uh, like I said, I'll uh, put in the description how to get this uh, little app store thing on your uh, on your PC. It's really simple. You just go on, I'm sure it's called bluestacks.com or something like that. Download a little program and uh, yeah, basically just create a Google account and sign in. So brilliant. Anyway, there you go. Thanks for watching everyone. Hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in the next episode.